Welcome back. Sethling here. I wanted to show off my new kind of read-only memory. As you see, each time I push the button, it cycles through a cell of the memory tape and uh, reads the next bit. If the output's 1, then it'll extend the piston. If the output's 0, it'll retract. I call it lupine read-only memory. For those of you who don't know what lupine means, it means a wolf. Yep, I'm using minecarts and wolves for my memory. Uh, each time I push the button, it cycles through the minecarts. Um, the button extends a piston, which is able to push the minecart because up here at the top, there are a couple hatches keeping from the, the minecart from going all the way up against the block here, which means that the minecart's hanging over just enough into this block that it allows the piston to push it. And a piece of glass here stops the piston from, uh, from pushing the second from bottom minecart. And there's also a stone pressure plate right here under this cart. And the stone pressure plate, when there's no wolf in the cart, it doesn't send a power signal. But when there is a wolf in the cart, it does send a power signal. So, lupine read-only memory. Thanks for watching.